My Best Friend Mario by Bertie Chesson. I want to tell you about my best friend. His name is Mario. The day that I met him, he was eating his lunch alone. I was nervous, but I walked over to his table. Can I sit with you for lunch? I asked. He said, sure. Mario seemed like a nice boy to me. He asked, do you want to share my snack? I smiled, sure. After lunch, I asked him, what happened to your leg? He said, when I was younger, I got sick and the doctors had to take it off. Did it hurt? Yes, it hurt a lot. But the pain was more about losing my leg than the hurt I felt when it was cut off. After a while, I got used to the pain of losing it, and now I don't feel it at all. I'm used to using a chair now. The bell rang, and lunch was over. I asked, can we play sometime? I would like that, said Mario. As I was walking home, there were kids in the park that were shouting at me. Hey, you! You and your friend in a wheelchair, how do you play? Yeah, you probably talk all the time. He can't do anything. I shouted, he can do anything that both of you can do better. I said it, but I wasn't really sure. All I knew was that Mario was a good person that should have friends. I wanted to be his friend. When I got home, I could not stop thinking about Mario. My mom saw my face. What's wrong, sweetie? I told her all about Mario and what happened with the kids at the park today. Mario is really nice, but I don't know how to play with him without him having a leg. My mom said, your heart is in the right place. Find out what Mario likes to do and play that. Keep being a good friend to him. He needs you to be kind and fair with him. You're right, mom. Can I call him? Sure, after you finish your homework. When I called Mario, I asked him, what do you like to do? He said, I like video games and I'm really good at basketball. Basketball? You play in your wheelchair? Yes, I can. It's not hard. It's like most things. With a lot of practice, it's all possible. Wow, I'd love to play basketball with you. Good. I'll meet you on the open basketball court at 1 o'clock. I'll be there. So, I was so excited. I don't know what'll happen, but I'll play fair. Mario beat me in two games. He made so many baskets, I lost count. And I was out of breath. Mario said, can I tell you something? Sure, I said, anything. I'm working really hard to walk again. That's great, but how? I go to a place that helps me practice walking. I walk and run with a leg that was made just for me. I'll even be able to ride a bike soon. Wow, Mario, that's great news. My friend Mario is special to me. He's a good friend. He's nice and funny. He's also very smart and does well in school. We still share lunch every day. It's been a few years since we met and Mario can still play anything and he's good at everything. Now that he's walking and running on his new leg, everyone wants Mario on their team. They see how special he is now, but I knew all along.